The pandemic is ruining fall sports plans for Philadelphia's Catholic League, but many parents and students are still pushing to bring them back. Today, organizers held a rally in hopes of getting the Archdiocese to change course. Eyewitness News reporter Dan Koo was there. Angry players and parents are hoping their voice will be heard, but the Archdiocese will not budge. Everybody's playing. Everybody's playing except Philadelphia. Philadelphia Archdiocese, Philadelphia Public Schools. Why is that? Days after the PIAA will allow its member schools to play fall sports, the Archdiocese of Philadelphia went the other way, canceling their fall schedule. This is horrific. So Friday, student athletes and parents of Philadelphia Catholic League schools rallied outside the Archdiocese doors. Because it's not fair and every other school that schools that aren't even going back to school are playing. We got the announcement and we were devastated. This whole week has been like tumultuous at best. It's awful. Dawn Hoger's two daughters play for Archbishop Wood's soccer team. Many parents left the rally saying they may withhold tuition payments if sports are benched. There was no communication with us. We, we have a schedule. We were sent a schedule of what we're going to play. It's on my calendar. The girls have been training for a month now, you know, and and then it just came down like a ton of bricks. The Archdiocese is not considering reversing its decision like its Pittsburgh counterpart did this week, telling CBS3, like every difficult decision made in recent months as a result of the coronavirus, there are strong opinions on both sides. We respect those opinions, but the decision stands and will not be reversed. We understand that this virus is legitimate, but for this age group, this age demographic, we think that they should be playing. We think that not playing will do more harm than, play, than, than playing. Some schools that play within the PCL but aren't necessarily full time members like LaSalle and St. Joe's Prep say they are looking into an independent schedule but are currently trying to figure out what that sort of configuration logistically could look like. Outside the Archdiocese of Philadelphia, Dan Koob, CBS3 Eyewitness News.